Thank you guys so, so much. It's fun to be on TV. I hear the camera adds 10 fingers. Let's do this. <laughs> People have been asking me how my life has changed since being on AGT. I'm being recognized in public a lot, which I still don't know how to feel about. Like, I'm really confident here, but out in the wild, it's a little different. Uh, I'll give you an example. After my audition aired, that following Saturday, I went to a garage sale because I party. That's <laughs> how we celebrate in Indiana. And I was, I was walking up to the sale, the guy who was running it, he saw me approaching and he went, Cripple Threat! <laughs> Which was awesome, because that means that he saw me on AGT, but no one else at the garage sale had. <laughs> So it sounded like he was just warning people that a handicapped guy was approaching. <laughs> like, you said I was crazy, but it's real. The cripple threat is here, they're among us. He learned to pick locks, he got out of his cage. <laughs> and it's hard to haggle down the price of a blender at that point, so. And I'm fist bumping a lot, everybody. I'm fist bumping just all day, just pff. I got tennis elbow from fist bumping so much, it's crazy. <laughs> like, I like to shake hands, that's what I do. Like, if you ever see me out in the street, like, I'm coming in hard and fast, just pow, let's do this. But like everyone, like nobody wants to like, everyone's fist bumping me. Like I've been so many people's clearly first fist bump ever. I'm like, you're 95, Ruth, all right? You don't fist bump. <laughs> so I've been trying to figure out why no one wants to shake my hand and I think I've narrowed it down to two reasons. I think number one, people don't want to shake my hand because they're afraid they're gonna like break it. Like. It's not made of crackers, everybody, all right? Like, there's bone in there. Terry Crews has shaken my hand many times, and I'm fine. None of you are Terry Crews, I promise. And the second reason I think people don't want to shake my hand, and I swear this is true, I think some people are concerned they're gonna catch it. Because they're coming in just, mm, no. And that is ridiculous, because the only way you're gonna catch it is if I sneeze in your mouth. That's the only way. And I feel a cold coming on. <laughs> and I'm inspiring a lot of people, which is amazing, but I think some people are getting inspired the wrong way. I had someone come up to me uh, after a show recently, and they were like, Ryan, you know what? I was having a pretty rough day. Things in my life just haven't been going that great. And then I saw you. <laughs> and I realized my life's not so bad anymore. <laughs> If any of you thought that when you saw me walk on this stage tonight, I want you to do me a huge favor and get out, all right? You don't deserve the rest of this. That is ridiculous. Because I can't do that to anyone else. Like, I couldn't stop a woman on the street and be like, ma'am, you know what? I was having a pretty rough day. I just wasn't feeling like a very attractive person. And then I saw you. And I realized I'm at least a seven, so thank you, thank you. Before I get out of here, I'm gonna end on a little bit of a sappy note. I wanna thank America's Got Talent, and I wanna thank all of you in America for voting me this far. It means the world to me. Thank you so much. If you can all vote for me tonight, I would really appreciate it. And if you don't vote for me, it's technically a hate crime, so. <laughs> all right, I'm Ryan Nemo, you guys. Thank you all so, so much. Hey everybody, that, wasn't that great? And if you want to see more, and I want you to subscribe, just click below. And I like likes, not even on this. If you see me in person, come up and tell me you like me. Just give me a thumbs up.